Hello again. So today I've decided that I want to do a quick review on um, Reveal by Calvin Klein. That's what the bottle looks like. It's very unique. Super heavy as well. Yeah. That's the box. Very simple. Quite sophisticated, isn't it? Okay. So let's talk about juice, because obviously that's the that's what's important. So inside we have something completely different to what you get used to. Um, when it comes to notes, there's some salt, there's a black pepper, a bit of iris, um, lots of sandalwood. So you can imagine that it's a very powdery, salty, ambery smell. I love it. There's not many people that talk about it either, which is um, very surprising to me. Because I love perfumes that are special, that are unique, that there's not many people that wears them either. So, yeah. And this is exactly one of those. It's very sensual. Um... It's very powdery, it's very woody, so it's not fresh, I wouldn't call it fresh. And there's no citruses in there either, there's no flowers, it's just iris, but it's a very little amount of iris. So to me, this smells like sand, this smells like beach, like being on your holiday and and putting on your sun lotion or something like that. It's, it's, it just takes you on vacation. It takes you to some tropical places. To me, that's how I feel when I'm wearing it. I absolutely love it. It's very long lasting and um, it's a very underrated uh, perfume in my opinion because everyone talks about uh, Euphoria by Calvin Klein. But Euphoria, it's too sweet, it's too sickly sweet, and it's just so popular, and people just, you know, constantly talk about Euphoria, which which I got bored with it. So I was looking for something different, and this is definitely that. This cost me £24 on eBay, so that was, like, super cheap. Very affordable, very lovely fragrance. I always get tons of compliments, so it's a def definitely a compliment get getter. Um, yeah, try it if you like it. There you go. This was launched in 2014. Highly recommended. Highly, highly recommended one. Thank you for watching. Bye.